Let's try another partition coefficient uh, question um, using the same system, uh, caffeine and um, water and chloroform, so we can use all these same numbers. So it says in this question, um, we'll consider uh, aqueous solution of caffeine where we've added 1.5 grams of caffeine. So now we have just 1.5 grams of caffeine to 100 mils of water. And then extracted it using one 200 mil portion of chloroform. Okay, so now we've got 200 mils of chloroform. Okay. So instead of wanting to know the partition coefficient, which we know already, 9.33, it asks us three questions. What quantity of caffeine will be present in the 200 mil chloroform layer after the extraction? Uh, what quantity of caffeine will be present in the 100 mil uh, water layer after the extraction? And what percentage of the caffeine has been extracted from the original aqueous solution during this extraction? So how would we do this? Remember we said that the Kp is going to be uh, the solubility in solvent 2, so that's going to be chloroform, to the solubility of the solute in solvent 1, which is going to be water. Okay, so Solubility is grams per volume. Right? So, in other words, we have mass per volume. So, mass we'll say in sol solvent 2 per volume of solvent 2, divided by the mass in solvent 1, divided by the volume of solvent 1. Okay? So now what we can do is we can take these things apart. We can expand them. Whoops. And we can say, well, the mass of the solute in solvent 2 times 1 over the volume of solvent 2. Like that. And we can also say the mass of solvent 1 divided our times 1 divided by the volume of solvent 1. Like that. Okay, so um, 1 over solvent 2 divided by 1 over solvent 1 equals, right, solvent 2 solvent 1 equals volume of solvent 1 divided by the volume of solvent 2. Okay, so that's good and well. We've got that part down. But we don't know what mass is in solvent 1 and what mass is in solvent 2. But we do know the total mass of caffeine. And we know that that's going to equal the mass in 1 plus the mass in 2. Okay? So, um, since we started with it all in solvent 1, we'll just say... The mass of solvent 1 okay, is going to be 1.5 minus the mass that left. Okay. And then, of course, M2 stays as M2. Okay. So now, let's put all that information in. Probably have to erase some diagram here. Okay. 
Right? So what are we really looking for? M2. So what do we got? We've got M2 divided by 1.5 minus M2. And then V1, V2. And this is KP over here. Okay. So let's just plug and chug, okay? And then we'll solve for M2 eventually. So we know KP is 9.33. And we know V1 and V2. Volume of solvent one, 100. Sorry for the small board. I'm going to 
have to erase a little bit of stuff here. So the percentage of uh, caffeine extracted is going to be 1.42 grams divided by 1.50 grams times 100%. Okay, so 1.42. Too long of a video.